And coincidentally, last 2017, the Philippines was actually the chairman of ASEAN. Hey, Mabuhay! What's up, IS fam? From all our organizing partners, sponsors, organizing committees, and of course, our alumni, thank you for always supporting IS. So today is a very big day because today we are launching our daily video series about IS, its history and its essence, ASEAN, Sustainable Development Goals, and of course, content about you, the youth, okay? Today, we'll do a bit of history on how IS was actually formed. Are you curious? Our first event was called IS 2017 and it was held on November 27 to 29, 2017 inside Intramuros, Manila. And our very, very, very beautiful venue was provided by our partner, our organizing partner, LPU Pair. Thank you very much, guys, for providing our very first venue. So our story goes like this. Early 2017, we started out as alumni for the Harvard Project for Asians and International Relations. So basically, we wanted to bring a similar platform of what we experienced to all young people here in the Philippines. And coincidentally, last 2017, the Philippines was actually the chairman of ASEAN. So we actually wanted to contribute to the efforts of the Philippines and to support our country in being the leader of ASEAN that year. Thus, the ASEAN Youth Engagement Summit was born. Initially, we wanted to unite, engage, and empower the youth towards awareness of ASEAN. See, that's how the story goes. So, if you want to know more about how IS grew and developed, tune into our next video tomorrow. And if you enjoyed this video, we appreciate it so much if you follow us on Instagram and Facebook. And of course, we want to hear your thoughts. Please comment below your insights and we'll see you tomorrow, okay?